We have come to the fifth chapter of the Solo Ads series. In this chapter, you learn how to scale your Solo Ads business to keep it going. The Solo Ads broker business is highly dependent not only on the quality of the list, but also word of mouth. Your business has a very low chance of gaining frequent and loyal clients if you have poor results or low opt-ins percentage. There are two major ways for you to scale your Solo Ads broker business to ensure maximum performance each time around. 1. Maintaining and cultivating your list. 2. Provide testimonials and feedback of your performance. The first step is to maintain and cultivate your list. There are two effective methods to execute this. 1. Create valuable email content. Your content must offer incredible value if you want your subscribers to stay subscribed and forward your email to their family or friends that are not on the list. 2. Create multiple email subscription types. By segregating your email subscription types, you can be more focused by sending more targeted content to a very specific audience. The people in your list are more likely to click through emails that are specifically for them. Always bear in mind that you need to stay true to why people in your list opted in. Do not mislead them. The second step in scaling your solo ads business is to provide testimonials and feedback of your performance. As mentioned in the previous chapters, you can search for solo ad brokers and the list that they sell by joining Facebook groups. In these Facebook groups, you are able to view a wide range of testimonials from solo ad vendors, which consist of how did they build their list, how many clicks were ordered, how many clicks delivered, the opt-in percentage, tier 1 percentage, how many sales accumulated. By providing testimonials and feedback of your solo ads performance, you can build your credibility and advertise your business to your prospects. You can also ask for feedback from your previous clients.